Here we are in beautiful downtown Palm Beach and we're at the Grand Banks booth and we're checking out the latest from Grand Banks. It's the GB85. Today we're talking to Mark Richards, the CEO of Grand Banks. Uh, a lot to talk about here today, right Mark? Yeah, there sure is. It's uh, been a very interesting time over the last couple of years and we're just so happy to be back here in Palm Beach and you know, showing off our new flagship, the new Grand Banks 85, which I think you'll agree has come up really well. So when we talk about technology and yachting, we have a lot going on here at Grand Banks and all across the line. Why don't you tell us about that technology? Yeah, look, I mean, you know, when I came on board with Grand Banks seven years ago, the concept was to you know, really totally regenerate the whole brand and do something different and, and try and go in a whole new direction you know, in boating, basically. And uh, with my sailing background, the key element there was performance. You know, and, and, um, you know, I have a lot of experience in performance in race yachts and uh, so we've brought that on board with the, you know, the Grand Banks brand and a lot of technology, our V-Warp technology which is all about hull shape, you know, construction technique and high end materials, a lot of carbon fibre. Um, it's, it's changed our whole world and it's changed Grand Banks' world and um, yeah, the performance results are amazing. So Mark, when we're talking about this performance, we almost can have half the engine and get better efficiency almost to a half, correct? Yeah, look, at the end of the day, yeah, our goal with performance is to be the best in the world, uh, the most efficient powerboat in the world, and we've we've exceeded yeah we've, we've succeeded in that very very successfully, and um, we're virtually using half the fuel of any boat in the business for the same speeds, which means half the horsepower, half the emissions. It's really impressive, and um, and you know I think yeah the, the, the industry is really going to take note of this over the next few years. So as we focus here on the flagship, the GB85, here we're standing, I'm 6'1", you're taller than me. We have plenty of space, beautiful dark wood. Let's talk about the salon area of this beautiful GB85. Yeah, look, yeah, part of the design brief was to give people a big boat feel in a smaller boat, you know, 100 foot feel and an 85 foot boat. That was the whole concept here. And uh, so we really pushed the beam of the boat out so that we could actually, you know, create this sort of space and um, a lot of glass, big windows, good headroom. And as you can see, this gives you that feeling of luxury and space. And uh, once again, it's worked very well for us. So let's talk about some of the owner options on this particular boat. Yeah, look, it's um, like all of our boats, you know, customization is a big part of what we do and uh, building boats for what people want, not for what we want. It's, it's two very different things. But yeah, there's a lot of really cool features in this boat. You know, for example, the, the main State room downstairs has, has, a, has a piano, retractable piano, and some just really nice features that they really wanted, and, and they've you know, changed their, their, their layouts around to accommodate those sorts of things. But um, there's just so many features, cool features on this boat, which you know, we could be here for hours talking about them all. But it's um, yeah, it's what makes the boat very special, and everywhere you look, there's something special. So it's it's worked out well. So if we're going to navigate the boat, it's going to be from the Sky Lounge and we have room for the captain and more up there, correct? Yeah, that, that, that's right. The Sky Lounge, yeah, it's a very nice space. I mean, if you're doing a lot of miles or spending a lot of time on the boat and you have bad weather, you know, having an enclosed bridge, you know, properly enclosed, is, you know, it's an important feature of the boat. It gives you another whole living space, which is wonderful. Um, it opens up beautifully. It's got three retractable windows. It's got a huge sunroof. So if you want it open, you can't have it open. But um, if it's too hot or you know, too windy or whatever, raining, it's, uh, you can close it up and it's, it's a very usable space and a great place to drive from as well. And the aft end, a nice, beautiful summer kitchen, accommodations uh, both aft here in the main salon and above, correct? Yeah, that's right. I mean, look, entertaining is not going to be an issue on this boat. Plenty of preparation spaces. We have the beautifully enclosed galley here for the for the crew to prepare food for the for the um, for the, the owners. And you know, outside, you know, it's there's bar space everywhere, which is wonderful. So, and you don't forget about the crew on this boat either, right? No. Well, that was a, a really big feature for what we wanted to do for this particular size is create an amazing crew space so they can be comfortable, they can hang out and do their own thing. You know, most boats this size, the crew are sort of living with the owners, which is not desirable as, as you can imagine for a lot of people, but this has worked really well. And I think um, it's probably got one of the best crew quarters in it in the world for a boat of this size. So it's, it's, it's pretty special. So Mark, I really appreciate the opportunity because A, this boat is absolutely spectacular. Everywhere you look, there's so many features. And I know you have a lot more coming with the brands all across your brands. Uh, what do you have coming up in the future? Yeah, look, we have a lot of exciting stuff going, and I think it's um, you know, it's what I love doing, designing and building beautiful boats for people, you know, and it's uh, 
So yeah, we've got a new East Bay 60 coming out, you know, which is really exciting for the company. Um, East Bay has been sort of in hibernation for quite a while. We've had a little 44 footer, which has been a huge success for us, but um, the 60 is the next level again. And uh, yeah, so there's, you know, we're not going to die wondering, that's for sure. There's a lot of good stuff coming from GB Marine Group. Well, you know, we can't wait to see it and I appreciate your time, Mark. Thank you. Terrific. Thanks very much.